Coach, a tough loss tonight here in your home opener against Lipscomb, but uh, considering your opponent, the defending three-time Atlantic Sun champion, you have to be pleased. Yeah, I mean, that was an absolutely great match. Lipscomb is a phenomenal team. I thought we played really well. I thought they played really well. Um, you know, fortunately, it's not the outcome we wanted, but it was a great match, and I think for our first uh, conference game in the A-Sun, we did well, and I'm looking forward to uh, North Florida on Friday. A very big crowd on hand tonight in the region, so a lot of people, maybe their first volleyball match, and uh, they saw a thriller. Obviously not the result you wanted, but the crowd had to be something that your, your girls really enjoyed. Oh, the crowd was great. We love having crowds. It helps, you know, create some momentum for our players, and I, I think it was great. We hope they can come back on Friday and Saturday. Um, it definitely makes regions a fun place to play. You guys have been racking up the uh, frequent flyer miles here as of late with uh, trips up to the Northeast a couple of times, as well as some other tournaments around the country. Uh, finally home, a little bit of a home stand for you guys. You play Friday here and Saturday here, uh, so uh, maybe a chance for you guys to maybe rest a little bit, work a little bit more in practice, and spend some less time on a bus and a plane. Yes, it is very, very exciting to be at home. Um, you know, it's been a long four weeks on the road. I think we did a lot of great things, but it's definitely nice to be at home, to get some rest, to be in the class. I know we missed a lot of class and, you know, just get back at it on Wednesday and Thursday for this weekend. You kind of surprised her with the uh, the pregame ceremony, but Jenna Shriver got you at 4,000 career assists as a Norse on the road. A very big accomplishment for a volleyball, any volleyball player. Yeah, Jenna, Jenna's been great for NKU Volleyball. Um, you know, came in, started a freshman year, has been working really hard to get better. Um, I think she's done a great job. I think she's one of the best setters we've seen all year. I think she has a huge part of the reason that we are 12-2 and two right now. And, um, I look forward to see how many more assists she can get this season. 3-2 loss tonight to Lipscomb, uh, but very impressed with the Lipscomb, the three-time reigning Atlantic Sun champion, so uh, obviously a confidence going forward for you guys. Yes. We feel really good about ourselves, although it was a tough loss, but we can't hang our heads too low because we did awesome. They're the three-time defending champions, and we just did an amazing job against them, so I'm really confident going into the rest of the conference, and we're ready to get back at them in October when we play them again. Now, tonight, before the match, you were honored for your 4,000th career assist as a Norse. Uh, that's a lot of assists, so uh, did you have any idea you were even close to 4,000, or is that um, something that was kind of a surprise to you? I didn't know I was receiving the honor, actually, so that was a surprise, but I kind of had an idea that I was, but I mean, I wouldn't be able to reach that accomplishment without my passers being able to pass to me and my hitters putting the ball away, so it's just a good team effort. Now you're a senior, so you've been in the program this year for season. Uh, it seems like the fan support has grown each season, and uh, tonight the first home match for you guys, and it was a great crowd here at Regents Hall. Yeah, I was really excited that all the people came out and supported us, and although we lost, I hope they all had fun and enjoyed us playing, and I hope they come out this weekend and in other home matches.